Welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Darth Sloan and the next legendary that's going to be active on Golden Ridge Reserve is Goldstein. Got us about here. So what you want to do is you want to go out to all the known places that Goldstein has been found at before and I'm going to put a map up that's going to show where those known places are. And that's where you want to start. Now there's a possibility that he's in a new location, but the best thing to do, get your four or five friends together, spread out to those locations. And Goldstein's kind of easier to find because he jumps out of the water a lot. And you'll know him when you see him because he's a big 27 pound bass. So I'm just out here fishing for Orid trout right now. It's the current king of the catch. And I want to show you, if you look here, there's been eight spots that we have known. He was here last week. Um, last week, he was right above the starting outpost, so he was right here on the third spot. But he has also been known to be back here at this little divide on the river, right at the mouth of the river here. He's going to be here in these lily pads or over here in these, up here. So spread out in all these known locations. Get you four or five people together come Wednesday night, late Wednesday night, probably about 10 p.m. Eastern is when people go active. And now there could be a ninth spot. He may show up in a new spot. We don't know. Um, this is going to be the second time uh, that he's been active since um, the update. So it is September the 18th, Monday, September the 18th, 2023 on this recording of this video. So as of right now, I don't know which spot he's gonna be at, but he'll probably be at one of these spots unless they throw us a curveball and put him at a spot. So start out by going to these spots and I got this in the official Discord, guys. Uh, so when you join the angler, and listen, you gotta do this. Call the Wild, the angler, official Discord. You have to join this. If you go down under the angler chat, hit that resource hub everything you need is right there these reserve help sheets look golden ridge visit site you go right here any fish you want to know about the legendaries whatever hook charts bait charts everything that you need to know a ton of work thank you wedge thank you wilson and everybody else that worked on this i keep this up as i'm playing i keep it up, up and open once you get the location found, you know, that's half the battle. You'll look around. I like that if you're standing on the bank, in the boat, whatever, um, and you're going to set up any type of line that will catch a 27 pound fish. And he's going to fight. He's going to get that second wind and all that when he comes in close. You're going to have to fight him again. Uh, but to get him to bite, this is the trickiest one to get to bite, other than just sitting there and waiting patiently. This guy's kind of the opposite. So pay attention to this. This is what got me and why I had trouble initially getting him to bite. His traits, make sure anytime that you're fishing for anything that you check the traits out. Down here, for PC players, I don't know what the button is for console, but when we hit the F button, it shows the traits. Aggressive, he goes directly for a strike without nibbling. So if you were using some type of live bait, it's not gonna ding the bobber, he's gonna bite, right? Immediately. But he's, he jumps out of the water a lot, and he's huge, you'll know him when you see him. But check this out, ambusher. Bites only lures which have recently splashed in the water. So here's what you want to do. Go ahead and fish, because you might get lucky and throw it right in front of him anyway without seeing him. But use a number two popper, number two popper, and then whatever line to handle a 27 pound fish. You know, 33 pound, whatever you want to use, just to be safe. But fish, throw the popper out there, reel in for about five to 10 seconds, cut your line, cast somewhere else. Reel in five to 10 seconds. I was leaving my lure in. You know how we do, we throw it way out there and we reel it in, you know, over time. It'll only bite within that first five to 10 seconds. Once, once it's been in the water for a long time, past that, he's not gonna bite. So cut your line every five to 10 seconds, cut your line, 
cast in a different spot. Now you're constantly look, using your peripheral vision and watching for him to jump. Okay. When he jumps, if, if you're fishing over here and he jumps over here to the left, cut your line immediately, cast right at him. You know, you're going to have to gas a little bit. Like if he was 30 or 40 meters from you, then don't let your cast bar go all the way up and cast way out past him. Try to hit him. Try to hit, try to land as close to where he jumped at as you can. And so usually two or three seconds after reeling in, he's going to bite because he, that's what he does. He bites, he likes that splash and he goes for that splash when he hears it. So that's how you catch him. And that's where I was messing up. I was reeling in, you know, throwing it out there a hundred and some feet and reeling it in all the way. And he was never biting. And I was like, man, I can't get this thing to bite. And then my, my good buddy, Stevie, DW Stevie come and told me, he said, no, no, cast at him and only reel for five to 10 seconds and cut your line and always cast at him when you see him and he's gonna bite as soon as he hears the splash. So that's the difference with Goldstein. It's kind of different than the others. The others, you gotta kind of be patient and sit there and wait on them to bite, you know, like Sidewinder. Ooh, that's a tough one. But um, that's that's the difference with Goldstein. So that's pretty much it, guys. The the it, It's finding them, you know, you gotta find them. That's the biggest part of the battle, and then you gotta get him to bite, and then, you know, if you got a 33 pound line on, 27 pound line, I mean, I'm sure you can catch him with a little smaller line than that, just be ready for a fight, you know. And that will be the, uh, the legendary this week. All right, so I'm gonna go make me a Paul the Dominator now video. So you guys make sure if you like the content, hit that like button, notify bell, subscribe, and come on over on Twitch and watch our live streams. I'm always answering questions. I'm here to help guys. I am an official content creator, partnered content creator for Expansive Worlds. So don't be afraid to ask questions. Love this game. Love the hunter. I'm here for you guys. We will catch you next time. I'm Dar Sloan. Happy fishing. Cast it right at him right there. That was him that jumped. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Life is good. Life is good again. Yeah, I know you could use the lure on a spinning rod too. His final stand is huge. Then his final stand, right back out to 190 feet. Wow. Well, I thought this would be a lot easier than this at 27 pounds. Uh, I was wrong. Wow. This dude's uh, it's a good fight. I'm glad. I'm glad. I thought I was just going to yank him in here. Okay. Okay. I see you, Goldstein. 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 However you pronounce it. I see you. I tip my hat to you, sir. I wanted a fight. And the fight we got. We got our boy Goldstein, 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 whatever, however you pronounce it. We got him. We got him. Nice fish. <laughs>